Hey Cancer, welcome to your July monthly reading. Happy birthday. This is a collective reading, so it will not resonate with you all. If it doesn't resonate with you, I encourage you to check your sun, moon, and rising sign video on my channel as you may be sitting in that energy. Alternatively, you can also click the link in the description box below to my Instagram, Chelsea Trees, where I sell online personal readings all over the world through. Okay, let's get into your energy. Cancer. Cancer, the astrology sign that is luring around you or could be in your birth chart is the sign of Aquarius. Aquarius um, could be in your birth chart. There could be a person that's an Aquarius around you or you may meet an Aquarius soon, but there is strong Aquarius energy around you. The numerology number around you, Cancer, is the number of five. Five stands for change, challenge, and freedom. So there is a lot of changes coming up. Trust this transition is in your highest good. Prepare for massive, exciting shifts in your reality. Pay attention for 5 a.m. and 5 p.m. and anything to do with the number five, as the universe will be using that to direct you. Okay, Cancer. On the end here, we also have your planetology. And your planetology planet is the planet of Uranus. Uranus stands for breakthrough, new energy, transformations, originality, renewal, revolution, and eccentricity. So they are the energies that are backing you, Cancer. Let's jump into your cards. Your first card is the Two of Cups in Reverse Cancer, which is the energy of... There's an imbalance, there's broken communication between you and a person, there is a lot of tension. This will start to come to balance. So it'll either clear away from your energy and you'll accept as it as it is, or they may come back and you may find balance within this person through the start of July Cancer, but there is strong energy of that. This is also Sagittarian energy, so you may be dealing with a Sagittarius who's bringing balance to your life. In the middle of July, Cancer, we have the Page of Wands in reverse. The Page of Wands in reverse is there is a lack of direction. Someone is creating conflict because they're procrastinating too much and they're not making direction. If this is you, make sure you are very sure of where you want to go because the universe is constantly listening because the thing that has lack of direction is blocking you manifesting so to me that says it's you because it's saying you can't manifest at the moment because there's something that you don't know what you want to manifest or you don't know what you want to come true so you're feeling really out of touch with that or there's a person around you who's draining you who's blocking all this and you're holding on to them even though you know that they lack direction and they lack drive and they lack ambition to go a certain way. Um, but whatever that is, figure it out, Cancer, because you do need to clear that energy because it is sort of blocking you. Okay. In the end of July, Cancer, we have your depression resurfacing because of a lost, lost relationship or a lost soulmate or a lost love connection. There is, um, there is an imbalance between you and a person and it leaves you feeling really, really depressed and low and very sad through the end of July. And this could be that you're feeling lonely, but the thing is that there will, there will be the right things for you coming after, but there was too much disharmony in this connection that it wasn't really a safe place for you, Cancer. It wasn't a good place. It's better for you to be where you are now is what the universe is saying. The hidden energy for you is someone at work could be in love with you. It's a really hard month because you're grieving a lot of stuff, but someone in your work life has definitely, someone sees you working or sees you around your work and they really want to ask you out. They really want to approach you. They're really serious about this. They see you as a high value person. They're really romantic about it. They're sort of nervous of you, but they're really, they're just giving you time, but they're ready to step forward and ask you on a date. And that might be a massive surprise to you, Cancer. 
Okay, the advice for you, Cancer, is to take a shot. Don't take 12. Take one. Okay, maybe two and move on. Don't fucking force it. Allow that shit to come to you. Just relax and let everything flow to you at the moment, Cancer. Stop texting. Stop stalking. Stop checking on that person. Just fucking stop. Spend your time on someone worth it. Don't waste it on ridiculousness. Take a fucking trip. Go see some shit. Do some new things. Talk to people cooler than you. And stop obsessing. You are not the fucking center of the universe. Okay, Cancer. Now, what somebody is thinking about you, somebody who's energetically connected to you, could be a lover, an ex-lover, a friend. What somebody is thinking about you a lot through the month of July is you and I were too young. We both know I am not the one for you. I couldn't let you get close to me. I'm starting to understand our connection. I am grateful for the spiritual lesson. Read that one more time. You and I were too young. We both know I am not the one for you. I couldn't let you get close to me. I'm starting to understand our connection. I am grateful for the spiritual lesson. Okay, Cancer. And on the end here, we have your love and romance energy. So what's coming through for your love life is very soon. Clearly decide what you want so that it comes to you now. Soulmate. Yes, this is your soulmate. Getting to know each other. As you reveal your innermost selves to each other, your bond deepens. Yeah, Cancer, you really need to get over this past lover because this new one's coming in like fast as hell. Okay, Cancer, please like and subscribe as it really helps my channel. If you did want to book a personal reading, you can through the link in the description box below to my Instagram, Chelsea Therese. Sending you guys all so much love and light. Thank you for watching and I can't wait to see you next month for another monthly on my channel. See you, Cancer.